welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for April 7th until 13th. So let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. moving with an earth sign I feel like some Leos will also be moving into a new new job or new company in your workplace um, if you have been having a lot of struggles and strife and difficulties in your um, current company, then there will be an offer that's going to be coming your way, you know, with regards to a new job, new, uh, here, there's a new opportunity that already came out, good for you, now, huh, there will be a big change in the horizon that you're about to face, or that you're about to embrace, and you will be very happy with the positive events that's about to unfold, you know, within this coming week. And some of you will be moving into a new house or you'll be relocating with regards to your work or that is connected to your work. Or you will be moving into a new company or a new position altogether. Either way, even though you, you know, as much as you want to jump for joy, you want to rejoice and you want to celebrate, you want to announce it to everyone. You know, either it's a new opportunity or a new, it's a promotion or it's a new company altogether. It doesn't matter as long as you are finally be getting your wish, what you want, your desire to have a better salary, a higher benefits or, well, a higher pay, sorry, and higher benefits. And I feel like this is the start of your new chapter, new beginnings, and all of your hard works in the past are finally starting to, you know, to... Uh, come to fruition however if there are some things you know right instead of your if your instinct is telling you something do not just shrug it off okay yes there are a lot of positive things that's going to be coming your way and yes you're finally going to be getting your wish and you're going to be getting what you really want this time but it seems like you need to be a little bit more careful okay with your choices up ahead and of course with the people that will be getting a little bit envious of you because i feel like there will be some office politics that's going to be biting your back or that's going to be biting your ass this week and you just need to be a little bit more careful in losing your cool okay do not let anybody push you or provoke you okay because someone who's a younger air sign will be acting a little bit nasty towards you and they are in they will intentionally pull your leg and uh, you know just for you to lose your face and lose that opportunity altogether now you are feeling a little bit stuck in your current situation because the company that you or the company the department or the new position that you're about to wants you to make a decision right away but of course that right before you leave either it's a company a team a department or something like that there needs to be some handovers you know and uh, you also need to delegate or you need to train some new people that will be taking your place which is at this point you have a very short time okay so you you need to work longer hours to create the manuals and stuff like that and you also feel a little bit uh, constrained and a little bit limited because of, um, you know, with the new job or with the new office that you will be going to, it's a little bit further from wherever you are. And it's a little bit uh, further, you know, from your home or possibly that you have to be in long distance, you know, like an hour away or four hours away from your current place right now and there is somebody that you have to leave behind and this is what's been like you know this is what you're you've been struggling and you you know this is actually a sacrifice that you have to make because you're not yet sure whether your partner or whether your your spouse right now will be allowing you to do this but it seems like you need to move first on your own and then right after settling then you have to get them one by one now the main problem here is of course that if you're gonna move 
then you have to move or you have to relocate and if they re relocate what is going to happen to your spouse and they're also worried if they're going to be getting a job you know right away they are also afraid of getting you know uh, stagnated uh, while you are busy with your new career with your new beginnings and someone will also be feeling a little bit insecure and feeling a little bit deprived okay so you also have to understand from their own own point of view what are their fears and what are their issues and it's not just that you're just going to scoop them up and you know drag them all to to your new location there are a lot of things that you have to consider and if your kids are still going to school then of course you know that's also another thing so you have to be apart from them or you have to be away from them for like three months until everything else will get settled everything else you know will get smooth and you will also be doing your part to get a job for your partner so that all of you will be going there all together it will be a whole new environment and a different you know like um a different pace and also a different um surroundings but it's only a matter of accepting the changes that you will be going through and not to mention that of course you will have to go through some period of loneliness because you'll be away from your family for a little while now the thing here is everything will be going smooth and it seems like you will be getting the right signs and symbols and offers you know like the universe will be finding a way on how to help you with your current burdens because you are already preoccupied with your um current um work obligations and of course that there are still some some stuff that you have to play you know as a part in your uh family so the thing here is right after finding a job or you know when you finally have an idea that okay you can do this you can do that and you'll be able to get them a job you're going to be giving them some inputs they are not going to be in favor of that and they don't want to do it so they're expect that there will be some ar arguments or silent treatments or silent war between you and your spouse because they are not really ready for these changes especially that things are slowly doing good okay in their career right now so if ever that they are not gonna agree to this movement or to this move there will be some sacrifice that you have to make okay because i feel like your spouse wants to leave wants to stay behind uh, until that you know they're fully ready or until that they're um that they will be able to find some good positions in that area because right now they are not able or they won't be able to let go of their current position or their job and you know the company is good the money is good the position is good and so is you know so is the colleagues so if they will be moving in with if they will be moving to with you to a new place it will be another um adjustment okay <clears throat> so one of you needs to make a sacrifice there is going to be some period of loneliness whether you like it or not but it's all for good okay if you're also worried will they be able to get a job in that place that you're going to be in um it's going to take some time and i feel like even if you will be getting your kids with you they would want to be left behind meaning that there will be some period of separation and that is where some problems will also start arising well you know um that's what i was actually saying in the first part because if there are some good things you know that's uh, about to happen or that is going to happen you know that there are some things in return as well okay so anyway it's only a matter of cooperation communications discussion and you know sacrificing so the two of you can just sort it out and don't worry you know it will all fit in the right place and it will all you know go well just have a stronger faith, okay? Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Leo. If you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.